With this year's election, registered voters have three main ways to vote, either early and in person, in person on the day of, or by mail. In the tri-state area, New York is currently the only state that is allowing voters to vote early starting on October 24th to November 1st. Voters that live in New Jersey or Connecticut are only allowed to vote in person or by mail. If you decide to vote in person on election day, be sure to find your polling place. They typically open at around 6 a.m. to 9 p.m., but be sure to go at the time that works best for you. Finally, if you've decided to vote by mail, be sure to request your absentee ballot as soon as possible if you haven't received it already. Once you've received it, be sure to fill it out and send it back to your local Board of Elections at least seven days before the election day. Are you voting in person but don't know where your polling place is? Luckily, it's really easy to find out. First, open up your laptop and whatever search engine you use and type in vote.org. That will bring you to their website. Now scroll down and click on Polling Place Locator. After that, scroll down to find your state. Once you find your state, you will click on it and they will ask you for information such as your address and name. Just fill that out and then they will give you your polling place location. It is important to remember that your early voting polling place and your election day polling place could be different, so make sure that you check. Since the election is coming up on November 3rd, you may be wondering, how will I know what is on my ballot? In order to get more information about what will be on your ballot from credible resources, make sure to check out vote411.org. In addition to voting for the president this November 3rd, you will also be voting for various municipal and state offices, such as attorney general, governor, state senators, house representatives, and judges for both your municipal and Supreme Court districts.